An explosive device was found on Monday at the New York home of billionaire George Soros. Bidform police said the department received a phone call from the Soros residence in Westchester County about a suspicious package. An employee that works at the home found the package and opened it, revealing what appeared to be an explosive device, according to a press release from the Bedford Police Department. The employee then placed the package in a wooded area until authorities arrived. The department told Fox News that a suspicious package was found in a mailbox. The package contained bomb components, police said. Police referred Fox News to the FBI's New York office, which did not confirm the report. Soros was not home at the time of the incident, according to the New York Times. The bomb squad deactivated the device, and authorities have said there is no further threat to the area. The investigation has been turned over to the Joint Terrorism Task Force Division of the FBI. The wealthy liberal donor started his philanthropic efforts in 1979, but his contributions have not always been welcomed. Campaigns against Soros emerged in Romania, where the billionaire was accused of financing evil as well as in Macedonia, Serbia and Slovakia, and have escalated to some extent since President Donald Trump took office. Soros, who made his fortune in hedge funds, has donated heavily to liberal causes and is vilified on the right. He is also the subject of many unfounded conspiracy theories. Recently, conservative critics have, without evidence, accused him of secretly financing a caravan of Central American migrants to make their way north toward Mexico and the U.S. Others have falsely accused him of being a Nazi collaborator during World War II, when he was a child in Hungary. Activists frequently post the addresses of homes he owns in Westchester County, north of New York City on social media sometimes accompanied by ill wishes. The 88-year-old has focused his efforts as of late on the midterm elections in the U.S., and has funneled upwards of $15 million to Democrats as they push to regain control of Congress. Soros told The Times in July that for every Trump supporter there is more than one Trump enemy who will be more intent, more determined. In October, Soros was linked to a non-profit group called the Center for Popular Democracy, CPD, which rose to prominence for organizing civil disobedience actions and confronting several Republican lawmakers during the contentious hearings for then Supreme Court nominee Brett Kavanaugh. Soros' organization has donated to the CPD over the years, giving $1.5 million to the nonprofit in 2016 and 2017 through his Open Society Foundations. The records show he also donated in the past two years another $1.2 million to the non-profit sister organization Center for Popular Democracy Action. Thanks AP for help with this report. Thanks for watching. What did you think of this video? Let us know in the comments section below. You can also subscribe for more videos like these in your inbox. Now if you are seeking the latest trends in fashion, and electronics and gifts and more of the coolest things that you never knew existed at the best prices, Please feel free to visit www.atthesmall.com. Once again, that is www.atthesmall.com. Share this video with your friends and family. Since you're watching, we have a small favor to ask. More people are viewing our videos more than ever, but advertising revenues across the media are falling fast. And unlike many news organizations, we haven't put up a paywall. We want to keep our journalism as open as we can. So you can see why we need to ask for your help. Our videos and reports takes a lot of time, money and hard work to produce. Our investigative reporting uncovers unethical behavior and social injustice that helps to hold governments, companies and individuals to account. Through this we can, together, create meaningful change in the world. We do it because we believe our perspective matters, because it might well be your perspective too. For as little as one dollar you can support us, and it only takes a minute. Thank you. Like and share this video on Facebook and Twitter if you agree. Don't forget to support this channel by clicking on the donation link down below and subscribing so you never miss any of our trending reports. What do you think about this video? Scroll down to comment below. Now if you are seeking the truth or guidance or need a prayer request or studies, please visit followyeshva.com at www.follow. Y. E. S. H. U. A. Now.com. Please note that we have changed to a new YouTube channel, the link is in the description box below. Please subscribe to the new channel, as this one will no longer have new videos and reports posted to it anymore.